Yo, what's going on everyone? So in today's video, we're going to be using this all archer deck. And you might be wondering, well, these three are archers, but what about these cards? And the game defined, or sorry, not the game, but um, an archer is defined as someone who wields a bow, so that automatically includes the princess. And the firecracker's description says this is what happens when archers get bored. And the expo, while it's not wielded by anything, like, or sorry, no one's like wielding it. But what if I told you that there's a ghost that secretly wields it and uses it? You couldn't prove me wrong. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just kidding. I just want to win condition because this deck sucks. And arrows, because no arrows get fired by a bow, and mirror just for, uh, more archers, so uh, yeah, let's just get into it. Alright, up against a name I can't pronounce here, so this deck is pretty like horrendous. Um, the only reason I'm even doing it is because no one has um, done it before. And yeah, I actually had this idea like a while ago. Like, I think I tried to record this like a month ago, maybe. But the deck is just so bad that, like, I think I played, like, four or five, and I didn't win a single one. See, he was bowler here, so I'm not really too sure what we're playing. It's an interesting deck. Let's just go ahead and expo, I guess. Um, it's gonna be force out something else from him. Now, if we can go, go, go ahead and pop this queen ability. We might actually be able to get an expo lock here. Uh, never mind, not really looking like it. Okay, let's just let that baby dragon go, I guess. Unfortunately, we do get no damage on the tower there, but hopefully the princess can get a shot or two. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Um, I guess we'll go Mere Princess. I know he's he's not like low, low on Elixir, but he's like fairly low. So Princess does get a shot. Uh, let's go for our Split Archers account as Valkyrie. So we actually are in the lead right now, which is probably won't stay uh, true for this match. So we'll take it for as uh, long as we can, I guess. Okay, nice. So we know he has Bowler in hand, and I'm not really too sure what else. I did just kind of wake up, so I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna be playing the best today. So we do get some nice magic archer damage, so he plays his goblins, he was and baby dragon, so pretty expensive commitment from him here. Hopefully we can take out this Ewas. Okay, nice. So Ewas, Baby Dragon are taken care of. Let's go for our expo here. It's gonna be forced like Okay, bowler then. Okay. Hopefully the archer can shred before the she dies. I'm actually gonna go. Why would this Okay. I don't know why he did that, like, I know why he did it, but I just don't know why he did so soon. Um, let's just split archers in the back here. So again, we're still somehow up damage, which doesn't really make sense. Hopefully we can line up. Oh, wait, we actually did line up. I thought I messed up for a sec. Okay, we're good. Okay, so actually really good geometry there. What? What? Bro, what, what am I? What? I mean, it kind of makes sense, like, I guess. But just why? Okay, let's go for some more geometry on the tower there. He actually spent a bullet on that, I don't, I don't know if I agree with that too much. Yeah, that's some, the bullet just somehow waltzed his way back into the lane, I don't really know how, how this happened. Um, let's go for our expo, I don't, on, on the side I want to give boys now, yeah, exactly. It's not necessarily about getting an extra lock, it's just about uh, making him waste elixir so that he can't really go in. Let's just go ahead and match character, make sure that the side doesn't get too much damage. Probably just gonna go for like a NATO or Bowler or something. Okay, he goes for his Goblin, that's fine. Just Princess the back. Oh wait, he lets my Queen lock on. Wait, that is a lot of Queen damage, let's go Firecracker here. And we'll just go Mirror Archers, so that they're out of this poison. I did play pretty bad Archer, not gonna lie. Should have played a bit higher, because I gave him poison value. Let's go for our Expo here, then let's go for this Magic Archer. We're not on the tower, but... We are gonna get some decent damage. On, like, all these troops here. So 
Okay, we do shred through that baby dragon. Well, let's go Princess here for some free damage. Let's go, let's go for arrows, mere arrows. <laughs> That's kind of aggressive. Okay, we need to get some archers down low here. We need Queen the Tank for this bowler. Like, right now. Magic Archer. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was actually good defense. Good defense, good defense. Let's go for our expo here. Um, we're gonna go for some free Firecracker tip on the tower, hopefully. Because, yeah, we actually do get it. Let's go Archer's low here. We need to go clean up high. No, 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 that's not the card. That, that's not the card I played. What is this game? No, 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 wait, the game's throwing. No. Where the arrows, mirror arrow? Come on, come on. Oh my god, dude. What was that? I went to click Magic Archer and I hit the expo, dude. But, like, I'm still not used to this new phone, man. <laughs> oh, that was way too close. That was so free and I almost threw, the, threw there at the end. Alrighty, I'm really surprised we won this deck, especially on the first game. But yeah, let's just head into the next one. If food cut. Alright, up against General JH here. Guess we'll start off the pl or start off the game with Princess. Okay, and you'll start off the game with Mike. Uh, let's go archers and pop the queen ability. I need to shred this Mike Knight as quickly as I can. So yeah, Mega Knight's not exactly what we'd like to see. Um, we don't really have a tank. <laughs> Archer Queen is our tank, basically. Um, we, can split, we can split Archers for like, some good defense on some things, but we don't have like a pure tank for stuff like Mega Knight. Um, so yeah, we're, we're going to have to work our way around stuff like that. Let's go for a Magic Archer here for some Geometry on this Ghost. Okay, we're going to have to go for like this. How does that ban still dash my tower, dude? Like, I actually hate bandit. It's so annoying. Like, you, a bandit can be, like, right next to your tower, and it just doesn't matter sometimes. I'm gonna go queen high, because I feel like he's lightning, and I don't want him getting value on the tower. Um, we are gonna take a bunch of damage, but I can't really, like, stop him, unfortunately. Okay, he pops his queen ability, too. Let's go for archers here. Hopefully just kill this queen of his. Okay, nice. See, so there's there is no real way we win this. Like, I'm gonna be real. Like, there is not a single chance we win this matchup. Just it's just the Mega Knight Ram Rider plus Lightning combination. There is just absolutely nothing I can do. We're just gonna have to snipe this E Spirit with our Magic Archer. They're a pretty cheesy play, but I really don't have a choice right now. And, like, yeah, just... We just can't defend this queen. Like I said, this deck is really bad, but it's just a decent idea. At least at least for, like, on paper. And you're like, oh yeah, all archers, you know, that sounds kind of cool. But then you're like, oh, all archers, <laughs> and it doesn't sound so cool anymore. Okay, we need to take care of all that over there. Um... I'm just gonna spam Magic Archer here, um, like a goon. So it just, okay, nope, cool. So it distracts him, but I was gonna say that, and he just goes Magnite like, the pocket, like an even bigger goon. I couldn't even predict the goonery right there. But yeah, <laughs> this game is completely over. I will see you in the next one. If it would cut. Alright, up against Avari 2.8. Quite the interesting name. Let's go for our Princess at the Bridge. Mini Pekka Ice Spirit? I don't really know what this could be. Okay, I was gonna say, if that's a level 15 log, we might be uh, in a bit of trouble, but we should, yeah, we're good. Um, oh, well, he's level 14. Well, oh, like, he's still gonna have upgraded, I guess. But, uh, oh, this is the uh, Hog um, Princess Rocket deck, I believe. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Let's just go for our magic archer here, like this. We just need to get some free damage on the tower. We did get a little bit of damage, but... I will be very surprised if we win this. Uh, this is not an easy matchup, let's just say. 
Okay, he is an earthquake. Yeah, this is, okay. I, I'm, I'm not even going to wait to the end of the video to say this, just in case I forget. Like, just do not use this. Like, do not use this deck. It is genuinely terrible. Like, I, I don't know if there's, like, a worse deck I could actually advise you to use. Like, there's no tank. Like, there is nothing. It's just terrible. It, it, it is terrible. Also, let's just go for a magic card here. Get some free damage on Power Kill's Princess. Good pre arrow, but I don't think it really matters. Yeah, like, I would have hit the Ice Spirit and maybe got an extra hit, but I don't really care too much. Um, just go for Princess here. He might just go Log. You know, he, he does go for Bats. So. I think the real play here is, like, going. Okay. I guess we'll clean. Nah, I was gonna say Queen the back, but he just goes to Princess the Bridge. Um, pop our ability here. We want to kill this mini P.E.K.K.A. if we can. Okay, we need to pull this hog with our Expo. We don't have a play- or sorry, we don't have like any other choice, like that's our only play. Then let's go for our Expo over here. We're gonna have to go for an Arrows on this. Yeah, like, it's just- it doesn't matter, dude. I might log this, but that would actually be really smart, but I guess we'll have to see. Yeah, we'll need the Popper Queen ability immediately kill this hog. Uh, we're gonna have to go Expo like this. And of course, you get Princess the exact same <laughs> that moment. Yeah, it's, it's just over. Nothing we can do. Um, like, he is Hoggy Q, or like, it, well, sorry, it's an actual deck, that's why he won, but... Like I said, do not use this deck, this deck is terrible, I'm doing this for content, do not use this. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. If it cut. Thank you. Alright, we're up against a vampire here, apparently, so... We'll have to see how good this, uh, vampire is, don't have any, uh, garlic on me. Okay, just arrows. Also, I don't this is just me, but... Sometimes when I, like, leave a match, it goes to the main menu, somehow switches to the event tab, and then opens a chest at the exact same time. I don't know why it happens. It's like, okay, screw you. Because I'm not, like, doing anything. And then I just don't have a chest for, like, the daily task now. It, like, it's really annoying. Ooh, look at that. That was nasty. That was actually clean. Also, I think we're up against E Giant here. So, not what you want to see. Yeah, I just want to make sure I didn't take a hit there. I didn't really know the interaction on that brawler and all that fun stuff. Oh my god, he's got a false firecracker. Okay. We know that this guy has lightning for our queen and expo, or magic archer too, I guess. He might lighten that. Which is not what we really want to see here. I'm just gonna go Mere Princess, get more damage, just use zeros. No, why? Oh my god, dude, my finger just slipped. Ah, the amount of times my finger just slipped and it just screws me over is actually unreal. I just would have got like, like maybe a thousand damage there, but nope. That would make too much sense. Okay. Okay, he goes for his thing immediately. We, we're just going to have to pop the ability on this and just... Okay, that was a terrible tornado in my opinion. Uh, I might try and like use that to get king. I'm not sure. It doesn't. We're just going to have to try to like, get a push with this. I'm going to try and catch him off guard and go arrows. Oh, wait! Oh, oh. Why, man? You already had the firecracker down. Yeah, I'm not messing it up this time. Oh my god. Like, I'm so... I don't think... It wouldn't have mattered anyway. I still would have lost, but, like, that is so annoying that my fingers look. Let's go for our print. Okay. Let's just go for Marcher on the side here. I don't know what he's doing, but what was. 
Say, actually, what are you doing? Like, he's probably just trolling because he's a game like every, bleh, like every single person in this game. Like, I really just okay. Yeah, I was gonna say like, can you stop doing that and just win. <laughs> Knowing, like, I will never understand people who play up against a deck that is like not high. Like, it's not high in plain sight. Like, you know, it's visible in plain sight. Like, it is meant to be terrible, or so not meant to be terrible, but. Like, it is terrible. You can see it. Like, no one looks at this deck and thinks, Oh my god, I want to try that. It looks so overpowered in this meta. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. <laughs> like, like, just take the win. Like, they're probably BMing too, but I just have people muted just because it's annoying. But, uh, yeah, anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.